We're still following that breaking news, reports of a police shooting in Miami. Yeah, let's go back to Local 10's Roy Ramos joining us live from the scene with more on some new video that we're seeing. Roy. Yeah, we've just been able to obtain a new piece of cell phone video that was shot by residents in this area. As you can imagine, very frightening moments as they heard the shots fired. Still a very active investigation as those detectives continue to gather evidence from the scene right there. But let's take you to that video. Officers responded to a home in the area of Northwest 7th Court just before 58th Street, uh, just around 58th Street, just before 3 this afternoon. In that video uh, we have just obtained, you can see those officers met by three people who come out to the front porch. One man wearing red pants and a white shirt is seen carrying a long object in one hand when he's tased multiple times. It's during the second time that he is hit with that taser, he is seen charging at officers, and that is when he is shot. Now we've oh blurred this God. video because as he's oh falling to the ground, oh several God. more shots are fired by law enforcement. Oh now this God. second piece of video that we've obtained also shows those officers just moments after that shooting trying to treat that man for his injuries. This just moments before we learned he was rushed to Jackson's Ryder Trauma Center in serious condition. Now as we come back out live, you can see several of those officers right there. I've been able to count more than a dozen marked units with City of Miami Police. Right now we're working to find out why exactly they first responded to this area and what ultimately led up to that shooting. As we get to those details, we will be sure to let you know. For now, here in the City of Miami, Roy Ramos, Local 10 News. That is quite the scene. Roy, thank you.